feet slightly wider and shoulder distance apart. Slight bend in the knees. Bring your hands to your waist. And just act like that so you're about to sit down. So just shift your hips and butt back a little bit. And just relax. Pull your arms down by your side. Pull your shoulders up to your ears, breathing in, breathing out, rolling them back and down. Shoulders slightly engaged, but relaxed. Chin and nose in alignment with the spine. Chin slightly tucked. Let your mouth slightly open. Tongue may drift to the back of the front two teeth and the roof of the mouth. Just breathing in through the nose, the belly is rising and expanding. Breathing out through the nose, the belly falls and contracts. Just, your whole body is relaxed, yet slightly engaged. Feel all the points on your soles of your feet that are hitting the earth. Just connect with the earth, connect with the nature, the sounds, if you're outside. There's a lot of wind, there's cicadas here. And the sun coming through the leaves of the trees. You're breathing in, we're just loosening up the body, hands, twisting at the waist. Hands hitting the lower back. Loose and relaxed. Just breathing in through the nose. Breathing out through the nose. Slightly gazing over the shoulder. Bringing energy, the chi into the body, waking the body up. Make one fist, one of your hands, I start with my right, and pound this divot here under the collarbone. As your other hand hits the lower back. Breathing in through the nose. Breathing out through the nose. System and the lungs, heart, blood flow. Now you're going to take that fist and turn it into a flat palm. And then the next round, we're going to slap the upper back and the shoulder. Just gazing over the shoulder, breathing in through the nose, breathing out through the nose. Getting rid of tension, tightness in the neck and the shoulders and the back. Now the lower hands are going to come down to the hips and the IT band as you look down at the opposite heel. Bringing life force, energy into the leg. Slow it down and kind of wind back to center. Breathing in, reaching your hands out, up, over the head, and breathing out, hinging at the waist and swooping down to the earth. Curling back up, one vertebrae at a time. Breathing in, breathing out. Breathing in. One, just stay down. Bring in. Bring out. And you're just swinging a little bit to one side and then swinging up and around. Palms facing out. Breathing in. Coming up. Breathing out. Swing down. Just going in a 
circular fashion. Eater remaining planted. Basically swinging everything from the hips up. The fluid like motion. Now on the next one, you're going to stay down and you're going to swing back the other way. Yeah. Now, yoking the breath with the movement. Back up, and swing your arms out in front of you. We're gonna slip the natural motion, move the arms, think of effortless, effortless movements. So we're just gonna hit that point on the wrist as we swing up. There's blood flow and heart. Breathing in and out of the nose here. Warming up that point. I just stop hitting that point and let the arms swing back to the side. Now breathing in. Fingers dangling out in front. Moving up, moving the shoulder in a circular fashion. Speed it up a little bit. Moving in and out of the nose. Coming up through the center of the body. Arms loose and natural. Fluid like movement. up the shoulders. I had a guy tell me once that just this move fixed his shoulder problem. After years of shoulder problem. Slow it down, come back to the side. Now we're gonna kind of slightly pump, pump the legs a little bit. And breathing in, you're gonna look back at the upper claw. Up, swing back. Getting all the organs twisted and squeezed, getting blood flow, stretching the inner arm, shoulders. Slightly engaging the leg. And swinging the arms is a great warm up. The whole body. Just gonna slow it down. Come back to center. And we're gonna bring our arms up like an L, breathing in. Expanding, opening the chest, gazing up, pulling the elbows towards the ground, breathing out, bringing the arms together through the center body, tucking the tailbone and curling in. Curling up one vertebrae at a time, arms come up together, breathing in, L shape, looking up, opening the heart, breathing in, breathing out, curling, decompressing the spine. Spinal cord breathing, breathing in. Opening that chest, heart, breathing out, releasing, letting go. Feel as if every vertebrae is clicking into place. Breathing out. Breathing in. Expanding, opening, breathing out, releasing, decompressing. The 
last time breathing in, you're going to spiral up, twist to one side, opening up that side body, breathing out, releasing, coming back to center, curling. Spinal cord breathing, breathing in, breathing out, switching sides. Notice at the top there's a slight pause of the breath before you release and let go. Breathing in, slight pause, breathing out. Breathing in, breathing out. Do one more time on each side. back up to center this time, shake out the hands, bounce into the heels, cleansing breath into the nose, go all the way up, one more sip of air in, breathe out through the mouth, release any tension and tightness, do that a couple more times, breathing in, sip of air, breathing out, shaking out, any tension and tightness and soreness in the body, breathing in, sip the air in, breathing out, release. Bring your hands up to your chest area, shake them out, do some natural pounding into the heels, bring them up above the head, let's do another cleansing breath, sip the air, breathing out, release. One more time, breathing in. One more sip, breathing out, release. Bring hands down the side. Just close your eyes. Feel that buzzing, tingling sensation. Something your mind gives your mind something to pay attention to. And just put our hands on our hips here. Feet are about shoulder distance apart. Just make some wide hip circles. The next time you get to the front, we're going to stop and go the other direction. Moving your hips, each corner round in a circle. Get to the front here. We're going to stop, come back to center. We're just going to tilt to one side, looking up, stretching through the side body and the leg. Breathing in and out of the nose. Don't forget to breathe. Focusing on the breath. The movement. Come back to center. Bring our feet together. We make some knee circles one direction. Sometimes I lift my toes. If you feel like your knees are getting bothered. Kind of protects the knees a little bit. One direction. And when you get to the front this next time, we'll pause and go the other direction. Really good for preventative knee problems, even current knee problems. It has to be done on a regular basis. This time come to the front, stop, and then we're going to go outward circles. Breathing in through the nose, breathing out through the nose, and then backwards, inward circles. <laughs> when we get to the front this time, we're going to stop. Just bring your feet out to about shoulder distance apart. Shake out your hands. Bring the back of your wrists together. Breathing in, you're going to spiral the wrists in. Always keeping the wrists together. As you come forward, the front of the wrists will come together. Just 
rolling the hands in, coming in through the nose, coming out through the nose. keeping the wrists together as you spiral them in and rotate them. This time when we get to the front we're going to wrist it in the front of the wrist would be together and you're going to reverse it. Your hands relax, really like kind of rolling them, fingers sprawling out. Get to the front this time. We're gonna stop, shake out the wrist a little bit. We're gonna come up on one foot, and one foot in the air, and hands out and roll the wrist one direction as you roll the ankle the other direction. And reverse it. And bring the arms up like a bird, bring the leg down, moving the ankle up and down. Up to the other foot. Same thing on the other side. Take a little practice, but it's okay if you fall at first. Reverse it. Bird moving the leg up and down. Shake it out. There, we're going to do one more move. It's going to be full body massage, release any extra tension in the body, and renew your life force so you can go through the day with more energy. The feet about shoulder distance apart, slight bend in the knees, just readjust our Qigong stance, hands on the hips, shift the hips down like you're about to sit down, relax the lower body. Breathing in, roll, bringing the shoulders up to the ears, rolling them back and down. Chin, nose, head all in alignment with the spine. Now this time we're gonna breathe in, bring the arms up to the side, breathing in. Palms meet above you. Now as you breathe out, hands come down, hit the back of the crown of the head. Breathing out. The hands down on the side of the neck, fingers meet at the pit of the throat, pause with the breath, breathing in, you're going to switch directions, slowly breathing in, as you go all the way up, take one more sip of air in, and then lift up on the heels, pound them down, breathing out through the nose, pulling that energy down through the heart, the lower dantian, fingers spread out across the belly, to the lower back, just massage your lower back. Now you're breathing in, belly's expanding. As you breathe out, hands drag across the back of the legs. Yeah. Breathing in, coming up the inside of the legs. Thumbs interlace with the belly button. Just make some circles as you breathe out. Grounding that energy in your lower dantian, recentering. Hands to the side, breathing in. Palms meet, breathing out. Bringing the back of the head. Imagine like a yoke cracking on your head. Breathing out, dragging the fingers across the neck, down to the knee at the pit of the throat. Pause, breathing in, reverse the direction of the hands. One more sip of air in, come up on the heels, pound down, and bring that energy to the center of the body, down to the belly button, fingers massage the belly, lower back massage the lower back, adrenals, and kidneys, and we're going to add a move here, you're going to breathe in, you're going to support the lower back, and then you're going to breathe out, you're going to bend back. Take out the tongue, king up. Breathing in, come back to center. 
One more sip of air in. Come up on the heels. Pound down. Breathe out. And drag across the middle. Back of the leg. Breathing in. Coming up the inside of the leg. And thumbs interlace the belly button. Breathe out. Just make some circles here. Let's do that all together. <coughs> Excuse me. Twice. I'm just going to guide you on the breathing. <coughs> Excuse me. Breathing in. Breathing out. Breathing in. Reverse direction of the hands. One more sip of air in. Up on the heels. Pound down. Breathe out. Breathing in. Supporting the lower back. Breathing out. Slight back bend. Look up. Stick out the tongue. Breathe out through the mouth. Breathing in, coming back to center. One more sip of air in. Up on the heels, pound down, breathe out. Hands down the back of the legs. Breathe out. Breathing in, coming up the inside of the legs. Thumbs interlace at the belly button. Make some circles. Breathing in. Breathing out. Breathing in. Sip of air. The heels, breathe out. Breathing in. Support the lower back. Back bend, stick out the tongue, breathe out. Releasing any darkness, stagnant chi. Breathing in, coming back to center. Sip of air, pound on the heels, breathe out. Breathing in. Breathing out. Lower back, breathe out, stick out the tongue, back, back bend. Breathing in, come back to center. Sip of air, pound down from here, breathe out. Breathing in. Breathing out. Last time. Breathing in. Breathing out. Air, up the heels, breathe out. Breathing in. Work the lower back, tongue out. Breathing in. Sip the air, up the heels, breathe out. Circles with the belly. Breathing in, arms out. Pulling down the heavens. Imagine the cosmos before you, pulling all that energy into your hands, sending it back into the body, through the head, the brain, throat, heart, lung, stomach, kidneys, adrenals, reproductive, intestines, down through the legs and the feet. Breathing in, hands come out in front of you. Just connect with your breath, connect with the earth. Gratitude for this life. Breathing in, belly expands. Breathing out, hands come out to the side, clearing any stagnant leftover energy. Breathing in, scooping in the hands in front of you. Breathing in, pulling up earth energy, meeting cosmic energy, pulling it back down into the body. energy so you can give it back to the world, healing the body so you can be of service to others. Yeah. Breathing in, belly rises and expands, breathe out, clearing energy, pulling up earth energy, sky and cosmic energy into the hands, pulling it back into the body. Bring your feet together. Time, whatever you might need, pulling it through the body. Hands come up to 
the side breathing in. Now thumbs are going to interlace above the head. Now you're going to breathe out. You're just going to seal that energy into your third eye, your throat center, heart center, belly button, grounding the energy in your lower dantian. Thumbs come interlaced at your belly button. Close your eyes. Feel a sense of gratitude for this life. The opportunity to do this practice to recenter, realign, choose love, not fear. Be courageous. These are trying times. We need to use whatever we can to recenter and come back to our purpose. What is your purpose? I think everybody's purpose is to be present and then they can find what their purpose truly is. Wherever you are is where you are. Why not accept it completely? Why fight reality? Use what you have to be courageous. It's time to live, not time to die. When that time comes, it'll be that time. But right now you're alive. Hands out, up overhead, make a fist with your left hand, cover it with your right, hinge at the waist, bow, I thank you for joining me, many blessings, have a beautiful day, or evening, namaste.